Hey everyone, and welcome back to episode 534 of Fallout 4. Don't, don't mind pal to dance, just walking into a wall. I mean, I mean, out of? Into? You decide, glass full, Gl glass half full, half empty? I don't, I don't know. This dude also looks super menacing as he's walking up in, in my settlement with like a full blown raider gear. But last episode we were working on, oh, oh, I just noticed that, I gotta fix that. We were working on my house, is essentially what this is supposed to be in Sanctuary. Uh, dance. It's okay. It's okay, buddy. Buddy, dance, pal. Over here. Yeah. Okay, there you go. He, 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 he figured it out. It's supposed to be my little home here. I got a shop thing set up because, I mean, who doesn't have vendors in their home? Nah, it's more like a practicality sort of thing. I made a nice little area over here. I customized up a 10 millimeter, a bull revolt, bull no, or, um, what's my, what was it called again? I forget what the receiver part is, but, uh, yeah. I got, I got a fancy revolver, okay? I got a cool revolver. I put my Volt 111 jumpsuits in this display case, and I really do fear for them kind of going poof like that. I accidentally click on something. <laughs> Where'd the other one go? <laughs> oh, this game. Oh, this game. So, the display cases that I keep talking about, I was talking about last time, they are cool, but scary. The... just... Uh, is object snap on? Okay. Um, the way the game works, and the way open world games work, and the way Bethesda games work, it just, it, it, it leaves a bit to be desired when it comes to display cases leaving things quite literally out in the open, like what, it, what this is doing, and object manipulation in open world games and things like that, and stuff just disappearing, and stuff being taken, and these are things that I worry about. These are things I worry about. I wish I could just interact with the display case, tell it, oh hey, store this, I, kind of like this mod really, actually, and you just hang it up, there you go. That'd be really cool. Um, I, I don't have that luxury with a, a vanilla display case thing, so I just have to remember to be very careful, because as soon as I manipulate it, something's going to fall to the floor, and that's bad. That's bad. I wish there was more like a, an armor rack that was on the wall, it'd be really neat to hang up a, a plate of armor. Pistol rack, I thought that's... Why do these look slightly di Oh, these are... There's like wires. Okay, I was a little confused there. Single medium-sized weapon. It'd be cool to hang some... Some weapons right here. I could put a flamer on here. A flamethrower. Yeah, there, there, there's, there's a lot that I can do. But... I think we may need some paintings in here. I don't really believe we need any decorations like that. Any, any weird signs. But yeah, if you guys enjoyed all the building and all that crap and enjoying it like I am, I do appreciate if you take a moment to like the video. It does mean a lot. I know it's a little bit of a, it's a bit of a break from what we've been doing with all the questing. We've been really going out of our way to do some power questing lately, but eh, I want to have some fun building. No, I don't want to see abstract art. Abstract art is not art. Abstract art is poopy. Get out of here. We gotta have it all historical and things like that. We gotta have, we have Lord and Savior Todd Howard in our base, but eh, I'm thinking like puppy dogs and light, lighthouses and <laughs> I don't know, more colorful things, purely because this house is all wood and it's just, it's it's bland as, uh, as I'll get out. There's not too much you can really do about that. You, you use one building type, you stick with it for consistency sake, and if you change it, that's it'd be bad things happen. What was that one again? That was the one with the little docks there. I'm um, gonna have a cool little farm here. Yeah, there you go. Um, I really do want like a pool table somewhere too. I really like the way that looked in the other settlement down here. And you know, also all this power mess is just, it's, it's purely to power the lights temporarily so I can figure out if I like them, the positioning or not. Is there more flags? I don't need that. I have two upstairs. Mm, is there a funny sign I could hang here? <laughs> Only men allowed. No girls allowed. It's it's the man cave kind of thing. <laughs> Do something silly like that. These signs all look really difficult to read. That's that's a bit. That's a shame. I think it's the lighting. Eh. Restricted. Please keep out. No girls allowed. Keep out. Man cave. Yeah, I'm not gonna do anything like that. That'd be kind of funny, but eh. Eh, posters. We can hang up some posters, but they require actual power. There's some funny ones in here. There's there's a surprising amount in there. Look at that art variety. Look at that. That's, that's kind of cool, actually. But, <laughs> Mr. Pebbles, first kitty in space. 
I don't even like cats. I mean, kitties are cool. I don't like cats. Cats are mean. They're mean to, you. They're mean to the owners. They're like, cats are bullies. We, we've got a... Mer oh, what a... Oh, it's... Oh, that's right. They get power from the wall, not like individual power lines. I'm crazy. Sweet. There you go, Mr. Pebbles. Doing me good. Thanks, buddy. I'm gonna have some, some, some hot girly girlies. Put them up on the wall. I feel like it just cycled through the paintings. That was weird. Unless these are... These are the same, but what's the difference? Hold on. Do these have lights on top and the other ones don't? It's a, ah, those ones. Okay. I see how the paintings work. I never really paid enough attention. Ooh, that's cool. Hmm. No bowling. We'll do... Uh, that's Starlight Driving or whatever. We'll do a pinup, because I'm a... I'm a dirty guy. Grr. Yeah. There you go. That's all lit up and fancy and things like that. Cool. Just adding some stuff here. I think wish there was a better variety of flooring. I mean, it just isn't. The game is not very nice when it comes to what flooring you know, carpet setup you want. I don't know. It's a little bit stupid. You ask me. Uh, I, I think these are t a touch overused, but they do add a nice splash of color. And the vault boy and the vault grill. Uh, maybe. I can put that out front. Because, you know, Vault 111 and, you know, uh, <laughs> my character's background. Maybe that's a little. It's a personalized touch, don't you think? Albeit a bit silly. And if I saw that outside my neighbor's house, I'd be a bit confused. But, hey, man. And it's better than leaving this up. Putting a Christmas tree out front and then it's like, all it goes. Uh, it's, it's, it's October of the next year and you still have your Christmas decorations up. People people like that do exist. Those, those people are a little bit weird. Yep. Nuka Cola flag. Like, where are these things? I mean, I don't, I don't see it. Eh. Where were the other flags, too? Uh, there is decorations. Is it miscellaneous? No, no I went to power, power accident. Miscellaneous. Where are the flag poles is what I'm looking for. Even though they, they don't wave in the wind, which is a little bit silly and a bit annoying. It still looks cool, kind of having that out front. I mean, our character has a military background. There you go. He's a bit patriotic. Why not? Trash can. I guess I don't really have a trash can. I still, oh, I still need to make my kitchen. I don't really have a trash can up here, do I? I need a place to throw away all my junk. Here. Right, right, yeah, right there. I'm, I'm making a mess up here. Yeah! That's what he says. So, a kitchen. How... Can I build a kitchen? All these, all these little saw, saw horses and things. That's cool. Hmm. How, if at all? Oh, I should put a jukebox upstairs. Can I do up a kitchen? It's a great question. I mean, milk vending machines is close to a refrigerator unless I get the actual refrigerator, which can I? I wish it didn't say look up fail. That'd be nice. Furniture. It's not a container. That's the thing. Where the heck are the fridges? I don't. I'm, I know I'm looking at the tables. I mean, you wouldn't think of. You kind of would, but you also think miscellaneous, maybe. At least I do when I think of a pool table. I don't know about that. I truly do not know. I wouldn't even know what furniture set I'd use. Maybe this? Those tables are nice. A counter? Okay. Desk? Desk edition. I wonder if they actually snap. That'd be neat. Alright, um... I'll try to get some things laid out that I believe we can use for a kitchen. So a counter, things like that. Furniture shelves. Then we can use a store thing as needed. None of those really scream kitchen to me. Ice cooler, perhaps, but it's really, like, dirty and yucky one. No chairs, I mean... Where are those really, really nice white chairs we put all the way back at... Co or clean top nursery, I think. Might need a stool. I mean, you know, with a counter. The chair would go at the actual table, or maybe a dinner table. Here we go. I think four would be good. All I'm doing is just lining this up, or lining up like so I'm essentially plating it out, but it's not no dinner plate, you know. I'm getting this stuff laid out so I can see what I have access to. Decorations, just where is that fridge? could have swore it's a thing, like a straight up normal boring fridge. I mean, there are these things, but they're not fridges. 
In some of these buildings, I think there might have been a fridge, maybe. But aren't they the crappy broken down ones you can't shut? And if anything, I bet I scrapped them forever ago. Yeah, I wouldn't I wouldn't know. Can I, can I take that? This is part of the house. Huh. Look at that. You can steal a whole sink. Whoa. <laughs> it doesn't have a, a back texture to it, and it also has a weird little roof piece to it, so there's there's that. But I don't know. I'm, I'm looking through here and I'm just not seeing what I want. A grill? Ooh, that'd be cool to have my own little kitchen. I mean, you know, I guess I want that outside, but this is Fallout. We do what we want. <laughs> Where was that espresso machine? If I can if I can get this into my base somehow, I totally want it. There's just not too much customization individually with certain things as maybe I... I was hoping for. I mean, an ice box kind of, yeah, I'm a meh kitchen, I suppose, but I wish there's a little more to work with. I, we can go with a Nuka machine. That can be my fridge. So, where, oh, where is my fridge going to be? I guess this is the best spot in that corner. Or my kitchen, if I didn't say that, not my fridge. Um, I don't know what that just picked up. I don't know what I just interacted with, interacted with, but it didn't feel like any of the objects I was looking at, so I'm a little worried that I picked up the wrong thing. Put my espresso machine in the corner. I wonder if it does anything. I really doubt it. It'd be kind of funny. All right, uh, I just slap you down right there. You're like state of the art, pristine. Oh God, what are you doing? State of the art, pristine, and things. We do have objects snap on. Yeah, we do. These just don't snap to each other, you just have to do that one yourself. Which sucks, it'd be really cool if they were individually set up to snap. Oh god, the, the precision movement that you really can't do. <laughs> and you can try with your mouse and whatnot, but it'll probably never be what you want it. <laughs> That's half decent. There's a bit of clipping, but if you don't stare at it all day, you, you, you wouldn't know any better. I would like to get a stove, too. That'd be really cool. I would like this to scooch. I'll still power some stuff. So... I'm not going to be able to make, I don't believe, a full-blown kitchen as cool as I would have really liked it to be. I, I, can, I can just work with what I've got. Essentially, where are the shelves? Wall decorations. Shelves, no. So janky. Miscellaneous. And there were definitely shelves. Furniture. Shelves, aha. Let's see, what are you? Is this sort of like a metal one? These ones, eh, it's more industrial. This would... These work, but they blend in too well. This is just a slightly fancier version. We'll roll with it. I mean, I could space some things out. I could have some shelf space. I could put some more counters here. That'd be kind of cool. Just put some shelves down. I'll incorporate them as needed. Now, a table as well. Can I find a nice table to use? Because I didn't, I didn't put a table out here. No, I didn't. A nice table for the dinner table. That's not bad. That one ain't bad. Oh, there's the, this is where the counters and stuff were. There, cool. I wouldn't really think to look at tables for counters, but I guess it also sort of makes sense. I really wish there was a search function. You know how cool that'd be? I mean, maybe you, you don't quite know it. You can at least guess a few times with a search function until you get it. It's just better than nothing. Uh, I don't need two sinks. It's, that's a bit silly. So this one, honestly, is a very nice table. Uh, you know, now again, yeah, we're kind of, <laughs> we're kind of, I don't know, just winging this. There's only so much I can do with the game, but I, I just wanted to maybe try something different. First, is completely building up everything. Normally, I just build up functional things, turrets, stuff like that. You know, that, that, that's that's that, that's the settlement, and I'll probably still be doing all, all that too here. But I really wanted to. See what I could do to play play housekeeper, housemaker, homemaker, whatever you want to call it here. 
I wish, I just, mm, I wish there's a little bit more stuff that I can work with. There's probably a whole section I'm just not tapping into. That I just have not seen. That, that annoys me. We got four chairs here for dinner. Yum, 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 yum. Or lunch or whatever. Breakfast. Get your breakfast. Um, I don't know says breakfast is a joke. Oh, I hear that a lot here. Just breakfast. I think, it's, I think it's just a silly thing we say. I think it's a silly thing that one of, the, one of the kids in the family said that just, you know, every adult said to make fun of them. <laughs> what I would really like is if I could get some plates, but you can't just make them. Ooh, that's a, that's a nice counter, too. Toilet, eh. Put some plates on there. Here's an actual sink, but it's more like a bathroom sink versus, I mean, the counter doesn't have a faucet, though. Dispenser? For like what? Oh, here we go. I could slap that up on the wall, but that's again sort of a coffee maker. What is this thing? This almost looks more like makes food. Uh, almost a weird microwave, and like it shoots it out there. I mean, it's a dispenser, so you know that's what a dispenser does. It dispenses things. Here, All right, I'll make you accessible. I don't want to lose that. So I could just put it here, take up some, some counter space. Uh, okie doke. Uh, TV projector. I did say I needed a TV in here. I'm not sure how I feel, feel about this dispenser, though. I think we already have that fancy espresso machine to just be a little dumb. Would really like a sink, though, but it just feels out of place. Almost feels mandatory in a weird way, but it also feels out of place. Food cart. This is like, this is like a, sh this is straight up. A, this, this is a restaurant now. This ain't no home kitchen. Fish rack. Yeah, we just we gotta hang up fish in the house. Yeah, nah, that'd be silly. That'd make your house stinky. So, what TV are we rolling with? I think the ones at the end were better looking. Maybe. Yeah, probably this one. Well, we would want a TV somewhere. In the, in the, I guess this is the kitchen, this is the eating area. I'm gonna be able to watch some TV as I'm numbing on my breakfast. My breakfast. Um, no great place to put the thing. It actually requires power, but I think it'll, yep, it'll have power because of the house. Put it right here. You, know, you can sit at that table and watch television. It's a bit awkward, you know, being by the fridge, but Fallout, man. We do what we want here. Sure. Sure. Scooch. Shelf. I could put it over the TV and put some things on that. It'd be really nice to have things to put on there. Like, maybe when you built the shelf, you could say, or it gave you a selection of things. Produce, really? A weight bench produces happiness? I've never seen them use this. I don't know. You, 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 could, you could pick between an empty one and one with just decoration on it. I mean, if anything, it'd make... A little, little bit of sense to put this in the, the men cave to produce some happiness. You got to, got a pummel horse. I can be a gymnast. I mean, I need my exercise too when I'm not out there kicking ass and saving days, saving lives, and saving people and silly things. I don't know. Maybe we'll put it like right here. Uh, not too much room I really have to work with. I really wanted a pool table, but. Seeing this thing produce happiness, and I don't think the pool table produces happiness, which is kind of funny. Now, floor decorations. Floor coverings. Are more important now than they were earlier, because, well, you have a weight thingy. Hmm. Maybe that. And then maybe I scooch it over. Again, I sort of had it lined up with the staircase, but what's, what's the matter? Is that lined up? Half decent. Half decent. It's a start. Call that good. Call that good. So I still would like to decorate these dudes. Not a great selection here in a Sultron helmet. I could make them look kind of funny. Left arm, left leg, right arm, right leg. Combat armor chest piece. Any... No? I don't believe... There's, I could, there's a metal chess piece, but heavy leather chess piece. 
Ooh, there's army fatigues. Can I do that instead? Feeling a bit nostalgic. Shut up, dance. <laughs> He's yelling at me from here. Army fatigues, army fatigues. I already gave him that. There you go. You look kind of funny. You look kind of cool in a weird way. Sure, decoration. Use our imaginations just a wee bit. Can I use these? What? I've never seen this! Is this a thing? Dude, that's cool! Yeah, I'd love to see a normal... I'd love to see any human being in the world do that. Wearing all the armor he's wearing, carrying all the weapon he, all the weapons he's carrying. Not possible. Nope. Alright, can, can I get off this thing? I pressed D and I moved. Yeah, there's, there's no fucking way my character's that athletic. Let's... Let's see how strong we are, because you know how much strength it would require to do what he just did? A ridiculous amount of strength. Strength boost at it. That is, that is something I had no clue about, but is really neat to see that simply interacting with this thing gives you that boost. That's cool. I want to look at it in, in the Pip Boy, though. That's neat. Show effects. Uh, special perks or... Where would this be showing up? Mm. Where would this show up? Because it doesn't show up under here. Hide effects. I, 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 don't know, I don't know where that would show up, but that's cool. <laughs> I'd love to see a settler just run up there and use that, though. So power armor. I've got this pa uh, this poopy suit over here. It's you know you know it's definitely not the suit that I'd I'd choose. I mean both of these are pretty shitty, but let's go park it. We'll take it upstairs uh, until if I can bring some X zero one again. Like I say every time, it'd be awesome. I don't have any teeth. Dance has been freaking out. He's been flying around this. I don't know what's going on with Dance, but if I could bring T fifty or something, because it seems to be common with all the uh, slaying of Brotherhood peoples. Okay, Brotherhood peoples, don't don't get mad at me. Uh, park you here, steal the fusion core, craft, and then it should be what we want. It should be really nice to have more fusion core or more more fusion core, more power armor to work with. But there we are. If nothing else, a decoration. Still didn't even have the windows of the house that I was supposed to add, which is likely going to cause a problem with some of the design. <laughs> This is to be better done out front, I believe. Then we'll have to make sure that the the window's not connected to anything. I can get rid of this one. I know that I already know for sure that's not connected to anything. Structures wood, walls, let's go. Windows. What do we got? What's our selection here? Maybe the two big ones, because this is like showing you out front. There are no windows on this end. There is a flag there, and that's it. That's okay. Hmm. Sure. I want it to be nice and just fancy. I want to see things. I like the. I like it. Now this is a part of the kitchen that's not covered. Unlikely to be a good choice to put that window there. That window makes more sense. It's a little higher up. Neat. Still have to figure out where this wall shelf is going, but I would love to be able to just stack things on it. It's so strange to me that I can't. Remember, I can pick up junk and put it there, but that junk is just every time I come out, come out of the area, load it, it'll it'll behave very awkwardly. It'll be a problem. Dude, it's so much nicer up here with just those windows. Just having that ability to see there. That's that's something else. Nice. It's crazy to see what what a difference that little ip makes. It'd be really cool to have a window right there too. I could do it. Um Get rid of you. Let's see, window. That's a really big one. I think I can put both of these here. Sure. More window space. <laughs> I'll accept that. I'll take it. Now, if I put a fusion thingy up top or some generators up top, I could power all the lights. Easy peasy. I could power my turrets. Do I really want a f generator in here? Nah, I'd likely put it up on the roof. Or I could put it out back, you know, and cover it up or guard it or something is an aesthetic choice. Just having some fun here. 
There's more I can do in this place, absolutely. Absolutely, there's always going to be more things that I can do here. I'll never do it all. I'm just having some fun with what I've got. So I think I used that plant earlier. Or was it this one? Looks like this one. Ooh. It's so, like, bullshit close to both of these. I don't, I don't think it was... Yeah, it wasn't this one. I can tell by the, ba the base. Derp. Put you here. More color in the base. Some, like, a succulent over there. Got some dead plants. Yeah. What a, what a succulent over here by the window. Keep them just put one right there, but I'll put two. Again, more color in the base is what I'm going for. Just to break up the, the ugly wood that's everywhere. Now, what a shelf? How's that look? I mean, that's going to come through the wall a touch. Hold on, I can't see. Get out of the way. Eh, not really. You know? Okay, that looks surprisingly good. Better than I initially thought. Anything else I could just slap on top of the shelf? I could put a radio there. I don't have to use it. I got a TV and a radio. Oh, baby. We're, now we're getting places. Now this back here is <laughs> a total dead zone. I'll have to figure out what's going on over there, but... I'm liking it. It's different, you know? It's different from what I've done so far. It's it's cool. However, again, totally time. If I don't know if I said it again, or I don't know if I mentioned it in the first place. I, don't know, I lose track of what I say. It is totally time to wrap the episode up here, guys. Episode 534. I think windows on this part of the house would have made some sense. We'll see about maybe opening that up with the vendors. It should be really easy to do. But my house is looking really cool. Could be better. Could be different. But really cool so far. I could get some lights outside, like some street lights if I can. Do I have any like lamp posts or, or like yeah, there you go. Street light. Straight up street light. <laughs> I could totally do it. Oh, oh I'm loving it. I hope you guys are enjoying it too. I hope I hope you're enjoying it as much as I am. But anyway guys, again, wrapping up here, episode five hundred and thirty four. Thank you all for watching, and I'll see you next time.